by Bethany Minel, news reporter SpaceX billed it as an endless road trip past Mars, but the Tesla blasted into space on Tuesday may actually be heading towards an asteroid belt. While the Cape Canaveral launch of Elon Musk's Falcon Heavy, the most powerful in the world, was a big success, it seems the red sports car may have overshot its mark. Image, the SpaceX Falcon Heavy rocket blasts off from Florida's Cape Canaveral following the launch, Musk tweeted, third burn successful, exceeded Mars orbit and kept going to the asteroid belt, a diagram showing the orbit of the roadster, driven by a mannequin called Starman, showed that it had gone further out into the solar system than originally planned. Other than entering Mars orbit, the Tesla looks to be on a path towards the asteroid belt between Mars and Jupiter. A SpaceX live stream showed the car cruising through the Van Allen radiation belt in Earth's magnetosphere, with David Bowie's Space Oddity playing in the background and a note on the dashboard saying, Don't panic, Musk, who wants to colonize Mars, said the approach was kind of silly and fun, but I think that silly and fun things are important. Video, launch puts electric car in orbit Initial projections indicate the car will get relatively close to the orbit of the dwarf planet series. The final fate of the car, which was unlikely to hit Mars on its initial path but now could collide with a space object on its new course, is unknown. It is possible its journey could last a billion years and take it as far as 250 million miles 400 million kilometers, from Earth, the same as a trip around the equator 10,000 times. Describing the launch as, probably the most exciting thing I have seen literally ever, Musk has now proved Falcon Heavy's credentials for putting objects into deep space. The Falcon Heavy is a space race game changer the only other blip for the mission was the rocket's central booster which, unlike the two side boosters, failed to safely return to Earth. Image, the rocket's thrust is equal to 18 jumbo jets Musk said that it had crashed into the Atlantic at 300 miles per hour, missing the floating landing platform. SpaceX hopes the 70-meter Falcon Heavy, which has a total of 27 engines and can carry a payload of 64 metric tons, will now be seen as a potential equipment carrier to deep space destinations. A second rocket nicknamed BFR, Big Falcon Rocket, is being developed by SpaceX with the intention of one day sending humans to the moon and Mars.